Hey crafty friends, it's Melissa. Welcome back to my channel. So I have, I'm going to try to film um, a couple of uh, haul videos. I've been getting a lot of stuff in and I just haven't been doing a lot of haul videos. Number one, because I don't want to be the enabler for you to go out and buy everything. But number two, just because as soon as I get things in, I have a tendency to try to organize them and get them where they need to be. And sometimes I just don't have time to make the video before that. But anyway, I'm going to show you guys um, a couple of different things that I got here from. One I got from... Um, this calls for confetti and then um, a recent little haul that I got from Frank's. And so let me show you guys, first of all, the this calls for confetti. You guys, <laughs> when I seen that they had a new release out, which they have been knocking it out of the park with all these cute little releases. Like, as you know, they have all the cute little embellishments and confettis and, and shaker mixes and all that. Well, they started doing dies and then they started doing stamps and paper pads. And so I'm super excited. But this one just made me, when I seen it, um, it came across on my email that it was available they'd been sneaking, you know, or sort of hinting at what their release is gonna, was going to be about. And when it came across my email and I clicked over there, I was like, immediately I need this because it was so stinking cute, you guys. So first of all, I, I placed the order and they sent a really cute um, bag of these little um, confetti pieces and their iridescent rainbow confettis. So cute. And it's a pretty good sized bag. I thought that's pretty awesome for a free gift. But you guys, okay. This paper pad sort of gives it away. It's just so cute. This is called Elusive Prints. And the paper pad, um, let's see, it has uh, two each of 12 designs. So you get 24 sheets. So the paper pad sort of has like a woodsy theme, you know, with all these different woodsy backgrounds and whatnot. I'm trying to get close so you guys can see really good. So, you know, I was like, okay, I'm intrigued because I couldn't imagine. I mean, the, so many things have been put out there, but how cute. Like, okay. So, I was like, all right, I'm down. What, what do we have going on? You guys, this whole release, check it out. It's about Bigfoot. Look, here's a Bigfoot silhouette. Oh, my gosh, this is so cute. But this is what really got me. Look at these Stamps. Oh my gosh, it's called Sentimental Sasquatch. Really? It says, I heard you were feeling a little squatchy. Feel better soon. The man, the myth, the legend. Social distance champion. Not all who wonder are lost. Believe. Happy Father's Day. Ooh, people, that couldn't be more me. <laughs> Believe in yourself even when no one else does. Dad, I'll always try to follow in your footsteps. And it's a great... Oh, it's your birthday. Make it legendary. But look at this guy. Oh, my God. Look how cute he is. I cannot stand it. So, of course, I had to pick up the um, matching die set, which cuts the two little guys out. It cuts the believe out and the little... I'm guessing that's a lollipop. It looks like a lollipop. This is so cute. Or maybe it's supposed to be a tiny balloon, but it looks like a lollipop. How cute is that? And then, of course, I had to pick up the little woodsy pieces, you know. And then it had a, um, they had a Bigfoot footprint. I know you can't see that, but this is, this is the, is that not cute? Oh my gosh. This is so stinking cute. I'm so excited for this release. It was just cute. I mean, I don't have a whole lot of like masculine themed things, but this one just tickled me immediately. I had to show it to my husband and he thought it was fun too. So anyway, I had to share that with you guys. Super cute. Go check them out. They have amazing prices. And so, um, I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm a big fan, big fan. So cute. Okay. Then I recently placed an order with Frank's for the new Simple Stories collection that is called Crafty Things. And when I got it in, I put it in my little um, little carriers. I always try to put the whole collection together um, so that I just, just grab and go when I want to. I was going to try to separate everything. I think I showed that in my video and that just, that doesn't work for me. So I really feel like I have to keep doing this. And these little um, storage pockets are in my Amazon store. So, um, and they're great priced. Uh, I just, I, 
whenever I get low, I'll order some more, sort of like with my magnets and my chipboard and whatnot. And anyway, but I have to show you guys this collection. It is so pretty. I was pleasantly surprised because I have their other crafty collection and I love it. I absolutely do. But I thought, yeah, I'm going to order this one because I know it's going to coordinate because, oops, sorry. That's one of the great things that they do is they do coordinate. I'm going to try to kick this back up. I hit it. Sorry. They do try to coordinate a lot of their paper collections so that you can you know uh, mix and match them and I love that so let me show you everything that I picked up this time and as soon as I got it and I saw how much I was going to love it I know that I'm going to be placing another order for this collection because collections that I love I like to have a good stash all right let's just start out you guys with one of the um six by eight paper pads and I'm going to flip through this really quick because the the patterns and stuff in here are just amazing. I'm glad I picked up two. I'm going to pick up two more. But um, this very front one, you have some cuddle parts. Super cute. On the back side of that, you have a really pretty rainbow. And look at this. You guys, I don't know how these colors are coming across on to you guys. But they're stunning. I was so pleasantly surprised. Then we have a script. Then we have this really cute, it's like a little loom. It's got the um, different, you know, crafty bits inside of it. So cute. You could fussy cut these out as well if you wanted. On the back side of it, it's got really pretty hearts and all those colors that I just absolutely love. Like pinks and purples and teals and aquas and yellows and just love them. And then it's got this one here, which is sort of a black or a gray black, grayish black background. And it's got the um, paintbrush with the floral bits. And then on the back side of it, you've got a grid. I thought this one was kind of funny. It's kind of, it, it looks like a color by number, which I'm guessing you could just choose your own colors and color it. Um, but on the back side of it, it's got sort of a geometric pattern. And then this is a very pretty sheet. I love the colors in this one. It's a floral. And then on the back side of that one is a very, very pretty yellow. It looks like it's coming through a little orange, but it's not. I promise you, it's a very pretty yellow. And then, again, I know it's a little overcast here. I had to close some of the windows because on at this time of the day, the, the sun is so bright. So that's like a notebook, and it's got floral bits in the corner. So cute. Then on the back side of that one, you guys, so pretty. Then this one just says snap. And then on the back side, oops, sorry, on the back side of it, another really pretty rainbow. Love that. And then these are like some little journaling bits or some little cut-aparts on the back side of that. I love this one. Look at this. It's kind of retro cassette tapes, and it's in all these beautiful colors. The aqua teal, the purples, the pink. So pretty. I love it. And then you have a page that has um, tags. I absolutely love all the tags. And then on the back side of that, look at that really, really pretty floral pattern. I love how these patterns are so basic that it's going to be so easy to mix and match um, card stocks and stuff with. Or even accent papers. And then here are some cut aparts, and these are so cute. And then it's got a really pretty grid on the other side. Beautiful colors. And then again, more cut aparts different ones love 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 these are so cute i'm absolutely in love with them and look at this floral pattern oh love it and then it starts all over again so i picked up two of those pads because i knew that i had to have extras then i did pick up now they had a whole a bunch of different um, ephemera packets that you could get. I didn't get a bunch of them. I got two. Um, I got the Crafty Things uh, Bits and Pieces. And this sort of give you an idea of what's in here. I'm not going to pull them out because I'll make a mess and I'll lose them. I like to get them in my little Velcro um, envelopes before I take anything out. And then this one. I'm going to order definitely tons more of these because I don't do a lot of ephemera. I should. I should do more. But um, this is beautiful. It's gold foiled. You have 58 pieces and this is called floral bits and you have all of these beautiful floral pieces. I'm sorry about the glare. Look at all those beautiful floral pieces you guys. 
Love, love, love. Now, I picked up this collection when they were having their Memorial Day sale, and you got 20% off. So, um, I won't get as, you know, as big a discount next time, but, you know, hey, I was excited to get this. Then I picked up the decorative brads. I love these brads. They're super cute. And they're not really brads because they don't go through the paper. They're just, like, stick-on brads. So, I picked up two of these. You've got some chipboard pieces here at the bottom. And then you've got all these really cute different size brads. So, I mean, you get one, two, three, four different sizes. Really, really nice. So, you've got 27 self-adhesive brads and five chipboard pieces. I picked up two of these because I knew I would want to make some really cute embellishments. I also picked up, and I'm sorry, you, oh, I did. Okay, I was like, I don't remember if I clipped that open. So, I picked up the sticker book, and um, sometimes I like these, and sometimes I don't. This time, I'm really glad that I did. So, let me show you guys what is in the sticker book. So you get all these really, really pretty stickers. Now me, I would take the stickers, probably trim them out, and put them on some heavyweight cardstock and make ephemera out of them. I just think they're cute. So you've got um, a die cutting machine, and you've got a little Memdex punch, some Memdexes there, you know, like a little um, boom box, um, a little journal. Here's a printer down here. You've just got stuff, and then this is like a little sitting area, a camera, a little um, straight blade, and then, I mean, pencils. You've got all kinds of cute stuff. Glue. It's just adorable. It really is. Super, super cute. Oh, I guess I go through the whole thing. Duh. Okay. And then on the next one, you have what looks like, you know, those little fluffy... Um, appliques it's i mean these are not they're stickers but super cute love that they did that they had some ephemera that you could get that was like these two now these would go really well with all the ones that you can get at like hobby lobby and whatnot so you get two pages of those with the different letters and then you've got some really cute labels just some additional things more labels at the bottom. I love these colors. They are so pretty and so much more vibrant than what they're showing out. Uh, this page just has a bunch of cute little like sentiments or sayings or whatever that you can add to your projects. These are perfect for grab and go. Love, love, love these. And all the different colors. So, so cute. And then this one, I'm guessing this is just kind of shows you what comes in the collection, but you can use these as, um, yeah, they're actual stickers, so that's cool. I mean, all of these are actual things you can buy from the collection. Washi tape and brads and all the different ephemera packets and the brad thing. And I think these are the foam stickers and super cute. And then this next one, you've got the little um, embroidery hoops with the cute, you know, little decoration inside. Love those. This one, you just get a whole lot of, like, different crafty bits. Super cute. Look at the little cart. The look, it's like a little dream box. That is so cute. And then more little flags and pennants and things. So cute with all these sayings. These are, this is a really a nice sticker one. And then you have some floral bits. And I can never get enough of the floral bits. So, so glad those are in there. And then this one is really cute. Um, I would make these into like little framed kind of things and run with them. I think that is so cute. Look, happy donuts, um, hot, fresh, something. These would be cute for, these would be really cute for Scrap Diva's um, little truck. How cute would that be? Or the little cart. But look, you get all kinds of cute little things. Love, love, love. Happy pizza, happy tacos, happy cookie. Happy cookies and happy burger. Life is a series of obstacles preventing me from crafting. That is my life right there. Make room for crafty adventures. I simply remember my favorite things. Um, crafty days ahead. Today I will create all kinds of really cool things. And then these would be really cute to add to buttons or the middle of rosettes or, you know, just all kinds of cute little crafty things. I love that. You guys are so cute. So I do love the sticker book. Then I got one of the um, chipboard stickers, and I will definitely be ordering more of these. They are gold foiled. Look at this. This is one of my favorites here. I love this. I mean, I love it all. Don't get me wrong, but 
Sorry, I'm trying to get the glare off so that you guys can see. And I know these are not coming through as vibrant and pretty as they are in person, but I promise you guys, they are so stunning. Love this camera. So cute. All right. Now I'm going to show you guys the 12 by 12 paper collection. And um, I did pick up extras of this stuff. So let me, okay, let me just... This was the extras I picked up. I picked up a lot of extra sheets of the ones that I really like. I do that. I, I like to have four sheets of the ones that I just really love. That way, in case I decide to do a swap or just want to do, you know, like some racks or something. So, so here you get um, 104 pieces. So, we have a 12 by 12 double-sided card. Uh, I'm sorry, 12 sheets of double-sided designer card stock, and then you get a cut-apart element sheet and a um, card stock sh sticker sheets with 92 stickers. I cannot speak. What is wrong with me? So that is what you get, and this is just sort of like a little preview of what you're going to see on the incredibly, incredibly cute stuff, you guys. So, and I'm not going to get too close to the camera because I'm already not going to be able to get this whole thing in here. But, I mean, it's just like the, the smaller pad, but in a bit much bigger version. I definitely, I don't know why I only, um, I didn't order a ton of these. And I really wish I had because this rainbow is just beautiful. It is really, really pretty. I love that. Well, I love it all. And then this, this sheet here, again, we have our embroidery hoops. Lots of them. Perfect for cut apart or to use as is. And then on the back, you have script. You could cut these out individually if you wanted to. Totally up to you. Here we have that um, geometric design. But on the other side of it, we have the beautiful hearts. So I love that. This is a long video. Sorry, guys. Um, and then, again, we have that notebook paper with that pretty floral bit on the other side. And then, again, more of that really pretty, pretty, pretty rainbow. And then this really beautiful, um, this one's called Cute and Happy. And I love that. It is happy. So it's really pretty. It's got such a pretty back pattern on it. And that really pretty yellow on the back. And then here are some of the cut aparts that they mentioned. So I love that, that you've just kind of got these little um, alphabet tiles with cute crafty things on them. And then the back side is so cute. But this side I think is just perfect for like if you have junk, like junk journals or what is that people do, the little daily things. Um, I don't do planners, but I think these are so cute. Alright, and then this one is again another rainbow from top to bottom. All that pretty rainbow. And then there is that color by number. <laughs> I just think that's funny, but it's cute. And then here are those really pretty tags again. So cute. Can't wait to use these. These, I always say that these are the perfect size for tag flips because you can make them chalky and they're cute. The other side of this one is where, you know, you can journal or write a message or whatever. I think this side is really useful. Both of them are. I love them both. So that's why I think they're perfect for um, a tag flip. Then you have this cut apart. Um which has like, or you can list, this is great for journaling, I guess. Super cute. On the other side, that one has a, looks like um, one of our um, healing mats. Super cute. Really beautiful blue color. And then more cut apart. So cute. I'm in love with this collection. I, I thought I was going to like it, but I didn't know when I got it that I was going to be like, okay, order more now. <laughs> This one is also so adorable. Love, love, love. And then, oh, this is my favorite sheet. I should have ordered like 20 of these. I love that so much. And then last, but no, no, we got the sticker sheet. So this is the last um, cardstock or paper sheet cut apart and then on the back side you have that really cool 
grid work. Super cute. And then here is the sticker sheet that comes with the collection. You get so many stickers. I think it said 92 stickers. So cute. Let me pull it away so you can see a little better. I'm all up in the camera. I'm admiring it myself. So much cuteness all up here. But then when you get to the bottom, again, more of these like little sayings and words that you can use. I picked up two extras of these and three extras of all of the cardstock pieces that I just really liked. So that is the new beautiful and fun um, collection from Simple Stories crafty things you guys it is so so cute so if you've been looking for a you know just kind of a general purpose crafting um something fun to send to one of your crafty besties or something you're wanting to make some projects i think this is perfect so anyway hop on over to frank's or you know wherever you like to shop and get your shopping on anyway until the next crafty video guys happy crafting